Welcome to this next section of my teaching on the Divine Soul Song of Yin Yang. I am Marilyn Smith. I am a worldwide representative of Dr. and Master Jigong Sha. And I am going to be sharing with you the wisdom in this book, Divine Soul Song, that Master Sha received from the Divine. And in this section, we're going to have a teaching on the fourth soul house, which in many traditions is called the heart chakra. The fourth soul house, the sound for that is Aya, and it is the area between the nipples. In Master Shah's teachings, it is called the message center. And the message center has many many functions. The most obvious is that it is the center for messages from the soul world to receive messages and to also communicate messages. It is also the center for forgiveness, love, transformation, karma, the center for Forgiveness, healing, for mental clarity, for emotional balance, and so much more. This is really a very key center. This soul house is very significant for all of those reasons, and as I said, so much more. In this series, I have referred to the soul houses. For 85% of the population, the soul resides in the first, second, or third soul house. For about 15%, it resides in the fourth soul house. This is the soul house for those who are enlightened. So if you have third eye abilities, or if you have direct communication abilities, you would be able to see or hear whether or not a person's soul is residing in this soul house. If it does, according to Master Shah's wisdom, that person is enlightened. Which, by the way, does not mean it's the end of the journey. It's really just the beginning. We can do a great deal to clear the blockages to have this soul house radiating beautiful golden light. And so we're going to do the same thing I have done in the other sections. I'm going to chant with some of the participants who are here just the first two words for the line, the whole line, connected with the fourth soul house. And those first two words are I, Ya. I in Mandarin means love. So this is the sound that we will use for strengthening and clarifying, radiating light in this soul house. So sit straight, have deep breath, and remember to breathe from your lower abdomen, from the Hui Yin at the base of your body. So everybody take a deep breath. Together. We'll do this five times. Again, deep breath. Deep breath. And when you take a deep breath, it's not just in your abdomen, but your whole entire body. Deep breath. Again. Wonderful. That is excellent. 
Now, you can use this little tiny short segment to practice this over and over again. And it's really excellent to practice just those two words, to really feel the strength, to build the strength, to radiate the light in your fourth soul house. Now what we're going to do is we're going to sing the entire line. So take a deep breath. Ah.